Hey everyone, this is Dr. Dale Schwartz. We're going to be treating anxiety and depression today with a real CrossFit workout. This one's called Annie. We'll be doing it from the home. And this one we use a jump rope. And others we do, we won't need a jump rope if you don't have one or you don't have space for one or it's too noisy. But this one does use a jump rope if you have the availability. Um, you also want to have a water bottle on hand and a stopwatch if you have it. All right, we're going to do a warm up. Then we're going to do the workout. And then we're going to talk about ways to vary the workout after to make it easier when you first get started. All right, here it is. This is Annie from CrossFit.com. If the rope stops, just keep the feet bouncing. That'll be, that'll, that'll be helpful. Any warm ups good. You want to protect your, your heels and ankles and knees. Here, get them nice and warm. Keep bouncing. It's just a warm up. Let's go. You got this phone. A lot of the phones have stopwatches on them. You don't need it, but it'll make it ten times better. I recommend it. All right. This is Annie. battery went out during, during the workout, but I got 812, it's pretty medium, and um, I was telling you before, before the battery went out, um, I feel like a different person. Um, I, I want to just remind people, we're working out for the mind now. The body comes second. It's, um, it's not a body image issue anymore. It's an issue of energy, depression, anxiety, and mental wellness. 
and that's why I'm working out, and that's why I hope you'll follow my lead, and so everyone will feel a little bit better regardless of the situation they're in, temporarily, or if they can't get out of the situation and they just need to remedy it, this is how they can do that. Good luck to everyone with that. Um, oh, what you didn't get to see at the end part of that video is I, got to, I showed the, um, the variations for, to make it easier. So you saw I was doing the double unders like that. Um, you can do it differently. This is what a beginner would look like. One, two, one, two. You can, you can count every double under you do. So just kind of casual and then add one, add two, add three. So that's how the beginner would do it. Um, and we'll, we'll, I'll, I'll write down other levels of how you can vary this up to make it easier for you. Okay? Talk to you soon.